Exactly. Dean Durham, thanks for coming on. Serial, uh, sorry, Sarah Ezekiel has motor neuron disease and she's unable to use her hands or to speak. She uses a computer to communicate, clicking on words on a screen by looking at them. And this year she started to use this technology to paint using her eyes. She's since had an exhibition and set up a website to sell some of her paintings. Olivia Skinner went to meet Surya Ezekiel at her home in North London. I was diagnosed with motor neuron disease in April 2000. I was 34 and pregnant with my second child. This disease is progressive and causes muscle weakness and wasting. It can strike anyone and the prognosis is two to five years. I've beaten the odds but I am now severely disabled and unable to speak. And you use the uh, eye gaze technology, Um, how does that work? It works by tracking eye movement via an infrared bar. In February of this year I started to use art software to create my work. It's similar to our software on an iPad but slightly trickier to use without hands. I've been using assistive technology to communicate and operate a computer since 2005. I've been using Toby Eye Gaze for two years and really love it. It's much faster than any other assistive technology and I can paint again. I always had great interest in art but gave up hope of creating anything again when I lost the use of my hands. You're using your eyes to um, move a cursor around the screen and to click on words and letters. What sort of a difference has the technology made to your life? Eye gaze technology has made my life far more enjoyable and I can do so much more. I run an online business called Eye Gaze Artist. And we're looking at some of your work now. What sort of thing do you paint? What inspires your work? I am inspired by other artists, such as Modigliani, Picasso and Hockney. I love nature and enjoy painting flowers and landscapes. This one I think is my favourite. It's a, a picture of a sort of orange flower. I was commissioned to paint the lily called Waiton by someone who lost her father to motor neuron disease. It's becoming a bestseller and it's one of my favourites. Another of your paintings is an abstract of teardrop shapes on a a pale background. They're beautiful colours, deep purples and red and blue and jewel tones. What inspired you to paint this one? I fell out of bed one morning and lay there for an hour because my garret didn't hear me. I was so distressed and started to paint teardrops. I knew that I would be fine, so decided to make them colourful to show my optimism for the future. You paint and sell your work to raise money for people to have the same use of the eye gaze technology. How much does it cost to have a similar system like this installed? It's around £5,000. I am selling my work and donating all of the proceeds to fund eye gaze technology for other people with motor neuron disease. There is no government funding for this vital equipment and I am passionate that everyone who needs it should have it. How are sales so far? I've raised around £3,000 so far and hope to buy someone an eye gaze computer in time for Christmas. That was Sarah Ezekiel talking to Olivia Skinner and Sarah will be exhibiting that work on the 5th and 6th of November at the Bloomsbury Theatre in London and you can see her paintings and work by other artists who use eye gaze technology on her website. There'll be a link to that on ours.